their go-to. Just irrepressible and a prolific score. Ty Lawson, he's checked in for Patrick Beverly. That's also good, so he hits both free throws. Here's Irving. He's coming off a 37-point game against Oklahoma City. And he also was a table setter in that game, Kevin. Just an amazing job with his passing. Just a joy to watch that one. LeBron kicks to Irving. Just four to shoot. With some arc, it's rebounded by Houston. Jordan's got his third rebound on the night. Harden with it. Guarded now by Irving. Ani is no luck. Boy, they were ready for him right there. I mean, totally collapsed the defense on him. Irving passes to Smith. Back to Irving. It's good for his second make. He's made two or three so far. Hard to get that one off with the size difference there. That makes it a tough individual matchup for him, especially down low. Well, took on the big guys going in there and challenging them like he did. But boy, that was a nice job. Jordan dishes to Lawson. Pulls up on the wing. Hits the front of the rim and out. Well, that's a very low percentage shot. Not good basketball at all. One he probably should have passed on. Smith with it, and it's Howard picking him up. Smith kicks to James. It's a pick by Love. Nice shot by James. And it's a five-point Cleveland lead. I mean, he was great in his last game, Clark, and clearly he has not lost that love and feel. Here's Lawson. And the shot counts. He's fouled, and it's a chance for a three-point play. Really aggressive. Substitution. Rockets trail by three. Beverly with the ball. Ariza has the open look, and he hits it to tie the game up. Ariza's got 10 points. And they've got to talk to you, each other on D there. Miscommunication, and now he's able to make a pay. LeBron up top, covered by Brewer. And Harris wide open. He shoots at three off the mark. Houston's gone to the three-pointer 11 times tonight, nailed five of them. Ariza sets a screen for Beverly. The dish to Ariza. Now, here's Brewer. Not a lot of room. Jordan against Thompson. Ariza no luck. Just tentative in the paint, lacking a little bit of confidence, allowed the defender to recover and contest that shot. Harris kicks to Thompson. Brewer with the steal. To the inside. It's deflected. And uh, 101 left in the first half of the game. LeBron's shot is good. Shots are just flowing for him right now, having a really strong quarter. Outside Jordan to the left side wing. Now, here's Beverly. He's tightly guarded. Here's Delavidova. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. James has got six assists here tonight. No doubt that is within his range. Well, I would hope so. He's a pro, and it was only a one-footer. Come on now. It's Jordan on the wing. Guarded by Harris. Baseline jumper. Good on that shot. And with that, the Cavalier lead is cut down to two on the bucket from Jordan. Cleveland's gone past the three-point line for 13 of their shots. They're six of 13. Now 
Now here's James covered by Brewer. LeBron outside. Picked by Verizhao. Della Vadova. That misses. Would have counted had it gone in. And the first half comes to a conclusion. Gentlemen, I'm over here with Tristan Thompson. And Here we go now, the start of the third quarter, welcoming you back in a closely contested first. Here's are making some changes. Brewer is checked in for Monty Units. Jordan comes in for James Harden. And it's Patrick Beverly in for Ty Lawson. Cleveland also making some changes. Verizhao comes in for Mozgov. And it's Thompson in for Kevin Love. So it's the Cavaliers now. A two-point game. And so in the game for the Cavaliers, J.R. Smith and LeBron at the two and three. Thompson and Verja at the four and five. And it's Irving at the one. Pick by Verja to the paint. That's in, coming off the assist from Thompson. That's the kind of aggressive and assertive play they need as we get closer and closer to crunch time. You're right, Clark. Just continue to pound it in the paint and get those easy points inside. Outside Jordan. Back to Beverly. Stolen by Thompson. The drive by LeBron. Here's Smith. And it's going to be two free throws. Drew contact on the shot. Now, when you think of the great playmakers in league history, John Stockton per game averaged double-digit dimes. Think of this. For his career, 15,806 career assists, a record you knew right off would stand for a very long time. And, guys, you know, you look up point guard in the dictionary, and there's a nice little picture of John Stockton there. I mean, he is an unreal distributor. Control the game like no one ever has before or since. It's no coincidence that Utah never missed the playoffs in any of the 19 seasons that John Stockton was at the helm. Now Beverly, he averages a bit over six points a game, and that one's good. Nine points for Dwight Howard. That's really told the story today, guys. I mean, throughout this game, they've been able to get the ball in tight and then finish. More active and more physical down low. That's what's really been the difference thus far. Here's James. Foul call that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. What a game for LeBron. He's got 24 points, and he's hit four from beyond the arc. A weapon with those three-point shots. You said it. His long-range jumpers are having a deadly effect. He hits both from the strike. They're really doing a good job working hard to get inside and draw contact a little more so than they did in the first half. And, and defensively, if you're trying to battle back, you can't keep sending them to the line. A shot by Ariza. Again, the Rockets score. The Cavaliers leading by five. Now, here is Smith. He's got 16. Screen by Smith. Irving with a clean look. The Cavaliers again can't hit. Rockets have gone 7 for 16 the second half from the field, shooting a bit under 50%. A reason no luck. Now that's terrific defense at the rim. Got right in his path. And you know they'll be conscious of him next time they take it inside, too. I mean, that's what really good defenders do. They make you think about their presence. And the foul called on Freak. And let's quickly check out the scoring breakdown here for the Cavaliers. You know, one of the big stories has been the three ball. It's been a key part of their offense throughout the game. Yeah, but, but they also never seem to get cold 
from mid-range. Just kept hitting those shots with consistency. Rockets trail by seven. And Beverly kicks to a reason. For the three. And James pulls it down. Cleveland's gone three of five with the long ball since entering the second half. Don't take your eyes off of him because he can make plays from multiple spots on the floor. Put the isolated cam on him. Houston's gone into a slump here from three-point range, shooting just one of five here in the third. James against Jordan. Kept alive by Houston. Second shot opportunity. Ariza with the bucket. Ariza's got 16. Really strong rebounding on the interior, and he gets the easy putback. The Cavaliers leading by seven. Smith's shot is good. They should continue to get the ball inside. The defense struggling to contain them. And when you make five in a row in close like that, it also takes pressure off your perimeter guys, too. Ariza against Verizhao. Now here's Jordan. He's guarded closely. Jordan can't get that one to fall. Just not much success when it comes to shooting. Smith the pass to Irving. He kicks it to Verizhao. And stolen by Howard. The drive by Jordan. So the whistle blows on the shot and two free throws for the contact right there. And a quick look at the numbers for Trevor Ariza. He's been in good form here the last few weeks. He's right around 13 points a night, five rebounds, and two assists. And this is the kind of strong, steady play you like to see. He's earning his keep and helping them win games. And guys, they're finally getting the consistency they wanted to see from him. Look for that to continue. You know, it's been a bad day for them at the line today as a whole, and far too often, that's the case for this team. And the Rockets making a change here. Thornton's checked in. And Cleveland also making a change. Kersey's checked in. So he picks up just one from the line that time. The Cavaliers leading by eight. Here's Smith. Good, and the assist goes to LeBron. And that's now 20 points for J.R. Smith. That's the third bucket in a row from the paint. This defense needs to fog those lanes in the middle much more effectively. You just cannot allow the offense to have that quality of a look each and every possession. Pass to LeBron. Look at oh, that jam. Wow. I mean, just beautiful. Sublime stuff, guys. <laughs> Absolutely sublime. Clark, he's going to start putting on a show now. <laughs> and, and that's usually how it goes. Once they get that lead, it's almost like they give him free reign. Special thanks to Kia for that sweet Kia slam cam replay. No question, he got bumped on that shot. Yeah, the officials didn't need to talk that one over. It was obvious. Two shots. You look at what Howard has done so far. He has nine rebounds. And he's added a steal to his stat line also. You know what? The number is not huge, but he has been doing some valuable defensive work for them. Irving's checked in for Kirsten. The screen from Thompson. Smith kicks to LeBron. Cleveland gets it back. The kick out to Irving. Thompson, a screen on Beverly. Picked by Verizhao. Over Brewer. James, no good. And that's the shot he has to take. Exactly. That's the right look. The decision was good. He just didn't execute. Here's Jordan. Buries it from about 10 feet away. Jordan's got to back down to single digits for the Rockets. Buckets, but he should have just gone straight up with it instead of trying to fade away. The third quarter comes to a close. Cavaliers lead by eight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back in just a moment. Final period of play just about to start. 